<laughs> Sorry, I kind of feel like I need to throw up. I don't know. Slay! Slay! Hello. Long time no see. Literally. It's been such a long time since... <gasps> it's been such a long time since I've... Oh my god. Oh my god. It's been such a long time since I've posted a video. Nobody cares. Oh my god. The last video I posted was like six months ago. <gasps> I know, I know I haven't posted in a while and I'm sorry for that. I am, trust me. I've been busy. <laughs> like I have been... You know. Okay, I haven't done anything, okay? I knew it. I knew it. But at least I have posted some shorts. Electric chair. That's something, I think. But what matters now is that I am finally making a video. Not a shorts video, a real video. So today... I will be doing a Q&A video where I answer your questions. Yeah. yeah. I will be answering questions you guys have personal. <laughs> oh, I will be. <laughs> I will be what? I will be answering questions you guys. What? I will be answering. What? I will be answering questions. I will be answering. I will be answering questions you guys have person personally. <laughs> I will be. I will be answering questions you guys personally have sent me. <laughs> yep, and I'm doing this because we hit 500,000 subscribers here on YouTube. Wow! Let's have a round of applause. <laughs> like, that's insane. I just want to thank everybody so much for you know, subscribing and supporting my channel and liking my content and enjoying my content. It really means a lot to me, so thank you. Aww. But all things aside, let's begin! Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! So I have my iPad. <laughs> okay, don't judge my case. It's like really old. Yeah, it's first edition. <laughs> You know, it's Bombastic like... Bombastic side eye. Criminal offensive side eye. It's on life support, basically. But I will be reading your questions from my iPad. Okay. First question. Okay, this is not really a question, but it says, I think it would be interesting if you tell us about just your everyday life, random facts about yourself. Okay. Okay. My life is boring. That's it. Like, I have the most uninteresting life. I literally do nothing. I do nothing. Slay! I wake up, depressed. I get dressed, depressed. I go to school, depressed. I arrive at school, depressed. I leave school, depressed. I come home from school, depressed. I eat dinner, depressed. And I go to bed, depressed. Yeah, that's my everyday life. Like, I do nothing. I do nothing at all. I study. <laughs> Okay, I'm not really great at studying. I try. I play games. <laughs> what the hell? On my computer. I play games like League of Legends. I know, don't judge me. I like playing League of Legends. <laughs> okay. And for those who want to know, I play support. I'm in Diamond. Stop the cap. That's, that's up there. And I really enjoy fighting games too, like Mortal Kombat and Tekken. But yeah, I there's nothing special about my life. I just I just live. Is YouTube your full-time job or not? It is not. <laughs> if YouTube was my full-time job, I would probably post every day. I consider my YouTube channel more like my hobby. It's my hobby, you know? I just do this for fun. When I started my YouTube channel, I had no goals of making money from my YouTube videos. I just wanted to do this for fun. On the other hand, I do have a job in like society. You know? Or whatever you call it. You stupid! And believe it or not, I work as a kindergarten teacher. What did he say? <laughs> kindergarten teacher. Kindergarten teacher. What? I know it might be very hard to imagine me working as a kindergarten teacher. Yeah, you think? Like me working with kids? What? What? But actually, I really enjoy it. I think it's fun. I think it's fun. I think it's fun. <laughs> 
Have you ever considered to become a K-pop artist yourself? Or go to an audition to be a K-pop trainee? Um... Everybody look at me! Yes! I have. Oh no! Okay, let me explain. Let me explain. Explain! Explain! Don't judge me, okay? This was back in like 2020. It was a long time ago. So when I was younger, I really, really, really wanted to become a K-pop artist. <laughs> So P Nation back in 2020 or something had auditions like global auditions. They were online, so so I applied. So I had to send in a video where I was dancing or singing, and I obviously chose dancing. And I think I danced to Adios by Everglow. Everglow. Oh my god, that was so bad. I did not know how to dance at all. Electric chair. So I sent the video in, I waited for like one week, I actually deleted it. I deleted my audition tape because I thought that I wasn't good enough. Sorry. So I just deleted it. At least I tried. A for effort. Do you support the LGBTQ plus community? No. Slay! I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I do. Of course I do. Everybody should get rights. Hey! Be who you are for you. What year did you get into K-pop? 1769, I think. K-pop was so good back then. The music was fire. Fire. I'm sorry. I got into K-pop in 2018, I think. So I've been a K-pop fan for five years or six. Six years! Oh, whoa! Wrap it up. How did you get into K-pop? I think this is the question I saw the most. <sighs> Back in 2018, I really liked this channel called React Channel. It was basically people reacting to stuff on YouTube. Nobody asked. And one day, I came across this video. And the video was about guessing which music video got the most views in like 24 hours. And on that list, there were two K-pop groups. And you might guess who they are. It was Blackpink and BTS. And the songs were Fake Love and Do 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 Do. And it just evolved. I pay my bills, my bills are bad. From there. And now I have a K-pop addiction. Thank you, Blackpink and BTS. Thank you. That's how I got into K-pop. How does it feel to be an idol without training? And how much have you spent on albums so far? You know, it's hard being an idol without training. You know, it's Oh, sorry, I'm kidding. Um, how much I've spent on albums? I don't even want to think about it. I have 20 albums. It's a lot, I know. I don't keep counts on how much money I spend on K-pop albums because when I see an album, I buy it. You know, I buy it. I can't control myself, okay? I have an addiction. It's Everglow. Can you... Can you open? But if I was to guess how much money I've spent, I would probably guess around a thousand, two thousand dollars. I know it's bad, it's bad, but photo cards. Okay, photo cards. I need photo cards. No. They make me happy. Oh! Let me enjoy buying K-pop albums in peace. Thank you. What is your favorite Everglow song? All of them. The whole discography. Period. Everglow has the best discography in the whole K-pop. There, I said it. And I, oh, I said it. I am not gonna take that back because it's true. And that's period. I have every single Everglow song on my list. I do, I actually do. I enjoy every single song. I don't think I can pick a favorite Everglow song. Liar! I like them all. Maybe La Di Da. I think La Di Da. La Di Da? La Di Da. Yeah. That's all I need to say. Are you gay? What's that? <laughs> I've never heard about gay. Gay before? <laughs> Is it an artist? Is it some kind of food? Is it a drink? Sorry, I, I can't, I can't answer a question that I've never like heard before. I've never heard about gay. <laughs> a homosexual? Are you homosexual? What am I? What am I? An idiot sandwich. Depressed. <laughs> yeah, am I a fruitcake or am I not? I'm homosexual. I don't know. You choose. Since you like K-pop, is it the only genre you listen to? I'm curious as your music taste is fire. It is fire. 
It is fire. Fire. I'm sorry. Stop it! But no, K-pop is not the only music genre I listen to. <gasps> I listen to a lot of pop music. My favorite pop artists pop, pop, pop. are Madison Beer, Tate McRae, and Ariana Grande. I just realized how crusty this case is. Like, look. Ew! Oh my god, it's really crusty, okay? I normally don't use my iPad a lot, that's why I haven't bought a new one. Don't judge. It's not okay to judge, okay? Attention, I'm just gonna write about stuff in the next question, so I didn't feel the need to edit it. You can skip it if it gets boring. Plans for the future. Um, jump. Oh my god! Oh no, but I actually have no plans for the future. I have no idea what I want to be, what I want to work with, what I want to do. I don't have all that figured out. I still have the mindset of a 15 year old. I don't feel grown up at all. But I kind of have to be a grown up because I'm 20. Oh god. I feel like a lot of people or society is pressuring you to already make these big decisions about what you want to do in the future. But some people don't have a plan for the future yet, especially at a young age. And that's me, I never had any plans whatsoever and I still don't have any plans. I'm still figuring out what I want to do with my life and I just hope I can figure out that one day. So my plans for the future right now is just existing or not. Like, the future is very unpredictable and you cannot do anything about it. If you feel like you already need to figure everything out, like, don't. Like, if I could go back in time and talk to myself, I would be like, do not stress. Or, like, you kind of have to though. Like, I don't know, don't, don't take any tips from me, okay? I'm not, I'm not a very good person to listen to. Just saying. What's the most overrated K-pop group in your opinion? I don't think any K-pop group is overrated at all. I believe that every K-pop group deserves all the fame they get. Nothing, period. Just think about all those years they have trained to just be in a group in itself. Like, they deserve it. They deserve all the fame they get. <laughs> and also, people's music taste is just different, you know? Yeah. Everybody is not gonna like your favorite K-pop group or your favorite song, your favorite artist. Yeah. And that's okay. That's totally fine. But what's not fine is making fun of other people for just not having the same music taste as you. Waking up in the yeah, that's all I had to say about that. Do you have any siblings? I unfortunately do. I have an older brother. I can show him right here. This is a picture of me, him, and his girlfriend. You can obviously see who got the best genes. <laughs> My brother is ugly, annoying, He's just ugly and annoying, yeah. My brother and I, we're completely the opposite. He's like, yo, bro, what's good? And I'm like, I don't like him. I don't like my brother. He can suck it. I hope he doesn't watch this video. If you were in a K-pop group, what position do you think you'll take? The position where I don't do anything because I have no talent. I would probably take the visual. Oh wait, I'm ugly as well. I would probably be the background dancer. The guy in the back just standing there and just waving. How well are you doing at school? And what grade are you in? I'm currently in uni- I'm currently in uni- What? I'm currently in university. That's what I was gonna say. Hello. I'm currently in the fourth semester and how well I'm doing at school. Homosexual. Some point. <laughs> Let, let's not talk about it, okay? I'm doing okay. <laughs> I've failed one class like two times <laughs> and I, oh. I hate school I hate university I hate everything about school I just want to be at home and play games that's all I want to do and buy K-pop albums What is your favorite childhood memory? I have to think about that I think my favorite childhood memory was just me being a child I just miss having no worries at all. I miss it so bad. Like, I turned 21 this year. Oh my god, I turned 21. Whoa, wrap it up. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. I cannot be turning 21. I'm a grandpa. I don't want to be 21. I want to be young. I want to be young. Please, make me young. I want to be young. I'm 15. I'm 15 years old still. I don't want to be 21. Okay, I think this will be the last question I will answer. <laughs> Finally! Because it's getting pretty dark. Do your parents support you to make videos on YouTube? Yeah, of course they think. 
That was not me. What, 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 what was that? What was that? Well, I think I'm scared. I think that was a ghost. Anyway, obviously my whole family thinks I'm a crazy person because they've seen my videos. They have. So they have seen me twerking. <laughs> but overall, my family is supportive of my social media thing. But that was it. Oh my god, I need the lights, I think. Thank you all for sending me a lot of questions. I think we got in like a thousand questions, so... That, that was a lot. That was a lot. But thank you for taking your time to send in these questions. I had really fun answering them. And I hope we can do this another time. Yeah. So, yeah. I don't know what to say. Bye. <laughs>